Yeah, man, you guys are seeing this right. Fortnite is back on the channel. And now, let me explain first of all, before I do get into this, I just want to say that it's not going to affect like anything on the channel already in the sense that Call of Duty will still be here as usual, like every single day. Like, legit, I'm going to upload Call of Duty every single day, but Fortnite will be in there sometimes, meaning like when I do upload Fortnite, it'll be like a double upload in the sense that this will go up, like Fortnite will go up, and then Call of Duty will go up like a, like a couple hours later, if you know what I'm saying, like at normal time, this will go up a little bit earlier. For those of you guys that are watching this, I'm like, yo, don't turn into a Fortnite channel. I'm not. <laughs> I'm still like uploading Call of Duty every day. This is not going to affect that whatsoever, like at all. I'm still uploading Call of Duty every day. It's just like I want to upload Fortnite as well. Get on my grind a little bit more, double upload sometimes so you guys can get a little bit more content. And also for those of you guys that have been asking me, because a lot, yo, you'd be surprised, you know, even though I'm, a, I'm primarily Call of Duty, a lot of people have been asking me to upload more Fortnite. So that's what I'm out here doing. So bear in mind, it will not affect Call of Duty whatsoever. Don't worry about that. But, but today we're talking about the end of Fortnite. Now, maybe wondering what I'm talking about. I'm basically Fortnite, I've been talking about some really big changes that a lot of people uh let's say they don't like it let's say they don't like it at all Talk about like huge changes that are changing the meta of Fortnite in terms of the building. They're saying that they don't really like the end game result in terms of like everyone's like having a build up, everyone's like sitting in towers and stuff like that, like a full on build up at the end. I didn't like that, man. So, what they're planning on doing is reducing the amount of resources that you can get. You guys have been seeing they've been doing that anyway. With, like the llamas, first of all, RIP llamas, they've been they've been nursed. You barely get any resources from them anymore. Also, even from like destroying trees, buildings, like you don't really get as many resources anymore. So, don't like the meta of the game right now in the sense that, bro, people like. Noobs don't really stand the chance. <laughs> Like, at all, bro. If you can't build, you're losing real quick. And a lot of people, I mean, a lot of people don't like that. They're trying to make it a lot more balanced for a lot more people, which a lot of people think that's the point, you know? Play the game more, get better at building, and then you'll have better results. But I don't know. A lot of people don't like this. A lot of people really hate this change. Like, they're really trying to change this game completely, even though, like, building is a core function of the game, which is why a lot of people really like the game as well. It's something different in comparison to, like, other battle royales. But hold on, let me hop into a game. I'll talk more. Five minutes. Also, if you do enjoy Fortnite and you want me to upload some more, if you smash like button on this video, I would really appreciate it. and also make sure you subscribe to the channel if you are new around here man more content more content coming <laughs> Yeah, man, I find this very interesting because you'd think, you know, building's one thing that this game has up on, like, anyone. And, if, you know, if any other game tried to, you know, mimic that, you know, add building into their game, then you'd get a lot of hate. Like, if we're being, hold up, you know what? I need to turn down this, bro. That's way too loud. But if any game tried to mimic that, they'd get hate instantly. They'd be called, like, a copy of Fortnite. So, regardless of all of that, they're trying to change that. They're trying to change that so it doesn't really have, I wouldn't say they don't want build fights, but they don't want it to have such a large impact as it does in games. Because if you can't build, again, you're not really going to win games. Again, people People's argument is the fact that you know we, we work hard for this man you work hard to be able to like learn to build and stuff like that okay let's get this chest oh i mean it's good but i kind of want it like a normal weapon hold on let me drink there yeah, that's people's argument like yo you learn to build that builds the skill gap you know what i'm saying so why not keep that in their game but i mean i guess the other argument is the fact that yo noobs have no chance it's not gonna be fun for noobs and also what you've also got to realize is the fact that yo you gotta realize that they've got to appeal like to you know the casuals as well like the casuals although it's hard to believe when i don't know you guys you guys that watch my videos or you guys that just watch youtube videos in general you probably play games quite a lot if we're being real you probably play games quite a lot you probably for the majority of the day, if you get back from school, you get back from work, you probably hop on some games, man. Which, you know, it's cool and all. A lot of people do that, but, you know, I do that. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But it's like, bro, most people, which is kind of surprising, even though, like, you don't really see them on Twitter, you don't really see them talking too much, but the casual player is very large proportion. In fact, it's most of the people that play the game. Like, the most, the people that just hop on randomly, you know, play a few games and hop straight off. That's like the majority of people, so you have to be able to appeal to those. Obviously, when you don't play as much, you're not really gonna be the best player, which means that you're not gonna have that much fun. Where the hell is a port for over there? What is building going on? All right, cool. Someone's near me. Where's this guy at? Oh. Sorry, man. Had to be done. Let me get your AR. Okay. All right. Uh, <laughs> yo, I'm a little bit rusty. This is my first game on in a while. Trust me, I've been getting better, and I will get better now. I'm starting, you know, I'm starting to upload it a bit more, and I'm lucky that I've got 
the chug jug. I just didn't have a shotgun. That was my main problem. Now we're good. But yeah, man. Let me know what you guys think of this, man. Let me know what you guys think of this whole change that will be coming pretty soon. Maybe they will switch it up because of all the hate that they've been getting. Although, I mean, it's clear that the game's been having success. <laughs> you guys know this is like the biggest game right now. A lot of people, a lot of people play this game every day. Like millions of people play this game every day. A lot of people still play it and enjoy it. But maybe like we're not seeing like the really like precise details. Probably like maybe the game's reached its peak. You know what I'm saying? Maybe the game's reached its peak and they're really trying to maintain that in a sense. Or maybe it's still going up, but a lot slower. You know what I'm saying? I'm trying to make sense of why they would update. Like, there must be some reason as to why they want to change the whole meta of the game. Maybe to keep it fresh. But I think, personally, it's to appeal more to the casual fans, which is what they need in order to, like, stay successful. But... That could be the end of Fortnite because the ones that I've trained, you know, played so hard, like played hours on end, trying to get better at building to try, you know, learn that meta in order to win a lot more of their game. It's kind of like, I don't know. Oh yeah, learn all that, but now we're gonna nerf all of it so you won't really need it too much. My bad. <laughs> Oh no, it's kind of a, it's kind of like a weird argument. But you guys know I play Call of Duty a lot, so I try and link it to Call of Duty in the sense that I remember when Call of Duty tried that in terms of like you know linking more to the casual fans, which means they added skill-based matchmaking, so noobs wouldn't really come up against that like, players that play the game a lot, so they wouldn't come up against players that you know were godlike or have, you know I've got some skill built up after all the years. Would come up against people of their own skill, which it, it sounds like it makes sense. If we're being real, it sounds like it makes sense. But those players that play it a lot, it really. I don't know, it kind of kills their game because like now they're coming up against players of their same skill even though they've just worked to like dominate other players and then that's where it kind of went downhill for Call of Duty so out like it might be the same thing for this game bro maybe they're making the same mistake they were talking about skill based matchmaker at one point in this for the same reason <laughs> but I don't think they ended up adding it or maybe they low key did oh man bro what are you talking about man now nah, but for real though it's weird as hell so I want to hear what you guys think I'm trying to get more kills but I don't know where anyone is I've not really seen too many people you know it's crazy though people also argue that building ruined the game as well Ooh. Ooh, warning message, boys. Yeah, people also argue that building ruined the game. So, I mean, there's like two sides of the argument. It's just like which side's more popular, which side makes more sense to follow. People argue building ruined the game just because like, like now there's a huge skill gap. Not everyone can have fun because they don't know how to build. But again, my opinion on that would be like, learn how to build. Like, what the hell? Yo, I apologize for the slow game, man, but I'm not seeing anyone right now. This is... Oh... Oh, bro. All right. That was a bad idea. What the hell? There's one, there's one like further back. Nope. Nope. Alright, well, let's give that another attempt. Get off of me, fool. Woo! Yo, he, he did not expect that whatsoever. Alright, we're off to a better start here, boys. Come out of that door. Just come out. I mean, he definitely listened. Bro! <laughs> Yo, how tell me how I did 25 damage from that far. That did not feel like a 25 damage distance, but I can do 9 damage from right next to him. No, I'm gonna challenge him. Let me drink one of these up. Oh, eat one of these. <laughs> My bad, kid. All right, we're good. All right, we got a scar now. Oh, <laughs> it only took two shots, boy. Oh yeah. What? What? <laughs> My bad kid. Yo, I was confused for a second though. I can't lie to you. He did get me confused for a hot second. Oh, we hit him as well. Oh, that was a headshot. What? There we go. What the hell? My! Woo! 
What the hell? Oh! Alright, I'm out. <laughs> Yo, I can't be dealing with it.